Okay. Okay. No, no camera, just read it. Good evening. My name is Marie Harvey, and I am doing my extra credit presentation on the effects of aging on the nervous system. The brain and nervous system are your body's control center. They control your body's movements, senses, thoughts, and memories. They also control the organs, such as the heart. Nerves are the pathways that carry signals to and from your brain and the rest of your body. The spinal cord is the bundle of nerves that runs from your brain down to the center of your back, and the nerves extend out from the spinal cord to every part of your body. As you age, your brain and nervous system go through natural changes. Your brain and spinal cord lose nerve cells and weight, which is called atrophy. Nerve cells may begin to pass messages more slowly than the rest. Waste products can collect in the brain tissue as nerve cells break down. This can cause abnormal changes in the brain called plaques and tangles to form. A fatty brown pigment called lipofusin can also build up in the nerve tissue. Breakdown of nerves can affect your senses. You might have reduced or lost reflexes or sensation. This leads to problems with movement which in turn compromises safety. Slowing of thought, memory, and thinking is a normal part of aging. These changes are not the same in everyone. Some people have, may have many changes in their nerves and brain tissues. Others have few changes. These changes are not always related to the effects on your ability to think. Dementia and severe memory loss are not a normal part of aging. They can be caused by brain diseases such as Alzheimer's disease, which doctors believe is due to the plaques and tangles forming in the brain and the buildup of lipofusin. Delirium is sudden and severe confusion that leads to changes in thinking and behavior. It is often due to illnesses that are not related to the brain. Infection can cause an older person to become severely confused. Certain medicines can also do this. Thinking and behavior problems can also be caused by poorly controlled diabetes. Rising and falling blood sugar levels can interfere with thought. Mental and physical exercise can help your brain stay sharp. Mental exercises including reading, doing crossword puzzles, and even stimulating conversation. Physical exercise 